Oh, the Prix de Cadran is next then. This is the French Gold Cup, of course. And it's a two and a half more Group 1. And the top one is Dimension of Time for Joshua Sutherland. Melancholy Cove and Red Harvest for Leon van Rinsburg. Alan Cat Crack for Craig Allen. Fosh and Drift for Vinnie Gerard in the hunt for Paul Rhodes. Quickfire Maria for James Shea. And Underground for Craig Beckwith. So just eight then in this big Group 1 race. And all installed. And away they go then. On this marathon two and a half mile trip, Eiffel Tower in the background. And we're going to slot aerial shot as we see them sort themselves out. The grey red half, grey underground, sorry, was pushing for the lead, but now Red Harvest has gone on just a bit. So nothing all that keen to lead, it would seem. And they are virtually crawling through the first furlong or so. And eventually. Maybe Quickfire Maria is going to try and live up to her name and take it on on the rail. Looks like that's a possibility now. Red Harvest has been moved forward. One or two of these jockeys playing it really cagey. But Red Harvest is in the lead. Doesn't look all that keen to be there either. The jockey's taking another tug. And now Quickfire Maria on the inside. Maybe being pushed along to take it up. It's difficult to tell what the tactics are with some of these most of them just seem to be wanting to crawl at this stage but Red Harvest and Quickfire Maria are reluctant leaders I would guess from in third place Island Cat Crate and then Underground with Melancholy Cove and Fosh and Drift and then Dimension of Time and In the Hunt is just the back marker on the inside so this could get to be a bit of a messy race could turn into a sprint and Red Harvest He's about a length up, I would guess, on quick fire Maria on the rail. You ought to tell from his angle, there's a gap men of probably two to four in a line. Alan Cat Crack and Melancholy Crove. Um, quick, um, Fosh and Drift and Underground. Then Dimension of Time is on the inside of that four. And on the inside of Dimension of Time is just in the hunt. So it's all somewhat pedestrian at this stage. Keeping their eye on each other. Nobody seems happy enough with their position at this point though. Nobody trying to make any sort of forward move as they come up past the coach park. That's the home straight. They've got to go around again. And as they go towards the winning post then now with a complete circuit to go. There's the big screen. The winning post will pass up shortly. It's a Strange looking straight this it does look like the winning post is going to come up a lot quicker than it does and it's quick fire Maria it's past the second big screen and eventually the winning post in the lead Red Harvest is second as they now swing out for another circuit and quick fire Maria is now the clear leader as you can see from that angle is a good two lengths up at least on Melancholy Cove and Red Harvest and Fosh and Drift is running quite wide on the track dimension of time is moving through on the inside the greys underground and Alan Cat Crack is also still there on the back of that group the one that's just detached a little bit at the back is in the hunt racing past the Eiffel Tower again and quick fire Maria in the lead from Red Harvest and Melancholy Cove Fosh and Drift is getting a bit closer on the outside. And Dimension of Time is getting much closer on the inside. In the hunt, the one that's just struggling a little bit at the back, being shook up by the jockey. Start making a forward move shortly with five furlongs still to go. And quick fire Maria in the lead. They haven't really started racing yet. Red Harvest is second. Alan Cat Crack is in third. Then Fosh and Drift and Melancholy Cove in underground. Dimension of Time is still in, the, in last place. He's in the hunt. He's going to have to get a move on if he wants to get into the hunt because he's not in it at the moment, but he's starting to make some ground, lengthening his stride. You can see those big strides on the outside and quickly move past one or two horses and right into the mix now then. So Quick Fire Maria in the lead with three to go. Quick Fire Maria leads by two lengths to the grey underground. Melancholy Cove. Then look at this one on the outside in the hunt. Stone last a moment ago and now coming through with a challenge. Also on the inside dimension of time is there. They're past the two pole and it's Quick Fire Maria in the lead from Melancholy Cove and in the hunt. 
There's still Quick Farmer here, but in the lead all the way. Now they're up the centre of the track in the hunt, and Melancholy go for another big chun. Dimension of Time's trying to get into it with Switch Angles, and in the hunt's taken it up. It's in the hunt who's gone on, man. In the hunt racing into the final half run. Oh, what a tremendous performance this has been by In the Hunt. And he hangs on to win this. In fact, he's pulling away. A pretty good performance, that great win for In the Hunt. In the Hunt takes it, Melancholy go on the ground. Dimension of Time, Red Harvest, Quick Farmer rear. And, well. Yeah, they've got a good price on that one in running as well. Said that a few times this week. Both on the flat and over the jumps, but some of these hold-up horses are really coming into their own this week. And in the hunt, Stone last and right out of it with less than a mile to go. Ends up winning it, running, pulling away. So in the hunt takes it. The pre to count run. So in the hunt, the winner then for Paul Rhodes, Melancholy Cove, second for Leon Van Rensburg, Underground for Craig Beckwith was a good third, Dimension of Time for Joshua Southern was fourth, and Red Harvest was fifth for Leon Van Rensburg.